In today's lesson we're going to be looking at expanding brackets, or if you want the posh maths way of saying that, expanding the product of two linear expressions. So here we go. You might see a question like this that will say expand this. Now the first thing you should think when you see the word expand, think of the x in expand. The x looks like a multiply sign, doesn't it? That's exactly what we're doing. When we're expanding brackets, we are multiplying everything in this bracket by everything in this bracket. So the way we do that is we draw ourselves a multiplication grid where we take everything in this bracket up here and we split it into its terms. So we take the x here and put it there. We take the plus 3 and put it there. Notice how I took the plus sign with the 3. Then this one, in this bracket, we put the 2x down the side and then we put the plus 5 below it. And then all we do is we just multiply out. So 2x times x is 2x squared. 2x times positive 3. 2x times 3 is 6x. Make sure you've got the plus sign there. And then x times positive 5 is plus 5x. And plus 5 times plus 3 is just plus 15. So, to get the answer, we just write out everything that we got as an answer in our multiplication grid. So, 2x squared plus 6x plus 5x plus 15. Now, we can collect these like terms, can't we? Plus 6x plus 5x. You'll notice there the diagonals on this grid, they're like terms. We can collect them. So our answer is actually 2x squared plus, and now we've got 6x and we add 5 more of them, we've got 11x plus 15. And that is the answer to this question. So let's look at one more. Same process now. We do ourselves a multiplication grid. Everything in this bracket goes on the top line. Make sure you take the plus with the 3. Everything in this bracket down the side, 3x. And then take the plus with 5. And then we just multiply out. 3x times 2x is 6x squared. 3x times positive 3 is plus 9x. 2x times plus 5 plus 10x. And plus 5 times plus 3 is plus 15. Write everything out that we got as answers in our multiplication grid. 6x squared plus 9x plus 10x plus 15. And then we combine these like terms, the, one of the, the, the ones that are on the diagonal. So we end up with 6x squared. We have 9x and we add 10 to them. We're left with plus 19x plus 15. And that is the answer to this one. Okay. Right, I've got some questions for you to do now. Write the questions out in full. Make sure you do your workings, do your multiplication grids. Pause the video now and do those questions. Okay, now play the video and look at the answers that we've got here. Check your answers to see if you got them right. If you didn't get them quite right, have a look and see if you can work out where you went wrong. It's really important that you can spot where you went wrong with maths. So if you do spot where you went wrong with some of them, write yourself a little comment. I went wrong here because I did this or I didn't do this. If you can't work out where you went wrong, that's no problem, but make sure you do ask your maths teacher so that they can show you. Very, very important.